Welcome. I'm Elizabeth Jensen. I'm the principal of Osset Temple Healing. I'm the founder of Osset Egyptian Temple Healing, which is quite an amazing healing modality that I've taught for many years now, about 17 years. I've recorded various uh, meditations. I've written Osset Egyptian oracle cards. And basically, I love Egypt and I love Goddess Osset. So, today I wanted to have a little meditation and healing and hypnosis meditation. And I'm going to do this for you tonight. And it's just uh, before Easter 2020 in Adelaide, South Australia. And just before I forget, if you're looking for me, You'll find my website is elizabethjensen.com.au and that's Elizabeth Jensen with an S. Okay, now I'm also a hypnotherapist and hypnotherapy teacher and uh, I uh, also teach healing as I said and meditation. I've done all these things for many, many years. So, tonight I'm just going to do a little meditation and healing because it's a time in the world where everyone's, well, many people are feeling quite sort of concerned about the future, about their health, about their families. And no, actually, you are safe. You're a child of the universe. Just here on Earth School for a little while. So you came here to be a little bit tested. And you are being tested perhaps at the moment. But when you connect with your Divine Mother, Goddess or Set, you will discover that peace, that understanding. And when you enter in a beautiful trance state, which is what hypnosis actually is, we can help you to access the unconscious mind. And the unconscious mind has an effect on your physical and emotional health to a large degree. So when we do that, you'll find that it's very easy when we put positive ideas into your mind to heal very quickly and rapidly. And indeed, uh, this helps you uh, to avoid catching all the current viruses and flus and things like that that are always floating around in one way or another. Okay. So I just want you to sit or lie very comfortably. If you're sitting in a chair, it's good to have one with um, sides on it and put your hands down, the palms of your hands down on your thighs, but sit with your spine straight. Or if you're lying on a, a bed or on the floor, that's fine. But just put your hands over your stomach or in your thighs because we all have healing energy in our hands and it's good to allow the healing energy which I'll ask to be downloaded for you today to flow into your body, okay? So, you don't have to do much while I'm doing this but just try the best to follow in your mind but if you do almost drift off, don't be concerned, that's fine. And I'll just give a warning, please only do this when you're relaxed comfortable in a safe place, not when you're driving or any operating machinery, anything like that, because it does take you into hypnotic trance. You'll wake up when the time is right, uh, if you're just meditating and sitting comfortably, but you don't want to be anywhere um, that uh, could come, cause harm. Okay, so just allow yourself to breathe in and out quite deeply. Be very peaceful and relaxed. And every breath you take, you're starting to become deeper and deeper and more deeply relaxed. You're becoming deeper and deeper and deeper, going down, down, down to a beautiful, peaceful state of being. Now, it's not difficult to access that healing state. Everyone got access that healing state. So 
So we're just going to keep going to a little bit deeper, breathing in and out, and in and out. And with every breath you take, just start to feel more and more peaceful, start to feel calm. And as you look up in your mind, we see a beautiful angel, the angel called Hamid. And he's an amazing bright white angel. And you see him in front of you, he's the angel of miracles. In your mind's eye you see him. Sometimes you can even see him in person. He's a very amazing angel. And as he stands there, he puts out his hands to you and says, please give me all your cares and worries and fears. And he has actually in his hands a big ball of light. It's a bit like a huge crystal ball, like I'm holding a huge one. And into this ball, you're going to place all your cares. So think, what are you concerned about at the moment? Your family, your friends, you're worried about them. Just say to the angel, Hamid, here are my concerns, my worries, my fears. I'm worried about my family. Say any, the name of anyone you're particularly concerned about. Any friends you're concerned about. Any situation you're con concerned about, any threats to your safety, to your well-being, anything. Just hand them over to the angel of miracles and ask him to deal with those concerns. You need to go into a deep, deep state of relaxation and peace to access healing. You can't deal with all these current concerns you have. So you're just going to hand them to the angel of miracles and ask that he do with them, please. And he smiles and agrees to that. So hand it. Last one now. And he smiles. And he just holds the crystal ball, waves his hands over the crystal ball and his wings over the crystal ball. And you just see the crystal ball glowing so brightly now, so brightly. And you realise he's just taken and dissolved all your cares and fears. Angels do that, you see. That's their reason for being. And uh, they wonder why we get so concerned about things when they're there waiting to take our problems from us. So... Gone. Now you can focus on you. You can focus on you. And the goddess all said, now you can see her just above me in the distance with a beautiful uh, solar disk, the orange disk above her head. And she's a mother goddess, the goddess of healing and prophecy in ancient Egypt. And she is here now to help you heal. She's here to help you heal. And uh, just feel her coming behind you now. And you feel her behind you. And as you feel her behind you, she touches your shoulders. And she's starting to wrap her beautiful wings around you. She's touching you wrapping her beautiful wings around you. That's right. Just allow those wings to come around you. Good. Now, she puts big white wings around you and in her hands touch the top of your head and you're aware that that's your crown chakra and she's opening your crown chakra. She's opening your crown chakra. And she puts her hand up into the air. And she draws down a beautiful stream of light. She has opened you up to source energy, 
healing energy and this energy comes into your crown right into your crown into your head into your throat to your shoulders your arms and into your hands and ever so slightly you feel a little tingling in your hand a little bit of tingling in your hand now she's put a hand here again and you feel a stronger stream of energy coming down into your hands Good. Now that's healing energy that she's given you. A little bit like Reiki energy, but it's more powerful. It's uh, more refined than the Reiki energy. It's from source. So that's so you will always have that healing uh, source of energy in your hands. That's good. Now she touches your shoulders. Good. And she says she's going to help you with a karmic release. Um, the, she's asking you to think of anything uh, that could be affecting you that will stop this healing being fully affected. And she works with the goddess Mutt, the goddess of truth and justice. And she works with um, Thehuti, or Toth is also called, Tiba of the Akashic Records, your Akashic Records. And uh, she's asking that any uh, Christmas bells, chants, negative energies, thoughts and beliefs placed to you in past lives affecting you today be released immediately, please. And any Christmas bells, chants, negative energies, thoughts and beliefs placed on you in this lifetime and affecting you in this lifetime be released immediately, please. With Osset, Mart, and Tehuti. And it's important to do this karmic release. You'll find after that, the healing is very quick, very easy. Now see yourself lying in the beautiful ancient Egyptian temple in the evening. You're outside under the stars in the evening. And people used to go to the temple of Isis on the River Nile to receive healing. And you'd stay there all night. And the priestesses and the goddesses would come and chant and sing, give you healing energies. Chant and sing and give you healing energies. And the chants would go deep, deep, deep into your unconscious mind. And the they would tell you you are healed, you are calm, you are peaceful, breathe in and out and feel that peace, feel that calmness. And you just seem to go deeper and deeper and deeper, down, down, down into a deep state of relaxation, a deep state of peace. Down, 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 deeper and deeper and deeper. That's right, your eyes are closed. So heavy, you can't open your eyes. You just want to sleep. And you go sleeping deeper and deeper and deeper. You'll still hear my words in the background. That's right. But you deep, deep, deep down into a deep, deep trance. And you're going even deeper, another level of consciousness. Down, 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 down. So calm, so peaceful. Deep, deep, peaceful. Now, I said calms, and she touches your heart chakra. And she's opening your heart chakra. As she opens your heart chakra, it looks like a beautiful pink and green lotus. And you can breathe so deeply when that's happened. Ah. Now she comes with a beautiful wings and a lot of blue energy. She spreads out within your body 
and around you. This is her divine blue healing energy. It's blue like the wall behind me. Deep, deep, deep healing. This beautiful indigo blue healing energy washes into you and through you and into you and through you. And Osir is saying, I will come each night for the next seven nights and give you amazing healing every night. Every night. But first you must request me just before you go to sleep. You call me, dear goddess Osir, please come and all night give me healing thoughts, healing dreams into my conscious, unconscious mind. Thank you. And she will come. If you have special requests, you ask us for those special requests to happen. And she will listen and she will help you. And every morning you wake up. And each morning when you wake up, you start to feel better and better and better. So you look forward to waking up in the morning. Because you feel much calmer, much peaceful, because you have such a good, peaceful, deep sleep, a good, healing sleep, whether it's for a short time or a long time, all your healing uh, dreams can occur at night or whenever you sleep into this deep state of peace and relaxation, into deep, deep hypnosis. This is how they healed in the sleep and dream temples of ancient Egypt. It's a very ancient way of healing. And now, we're it's leaving you for a little while. To breathe in in and out, and in and out. And it seems as though you've been dreaming for a long, long time. And now you're aware that uh, you sense light everywhere. And you open your eyes and you're actually looking at the sun. And you're looking at the blue sky and it's morning. You've been asleep all night in the temple. And now you're where you're back, where you started. You've come back to where you started, this deep healing meditation. And you sense you feel so much better. And you feel a wave of golden energy within you and around you. You remember the healing angel Hamid and you sense he's also being there transforming things for you and you get this feeling of excitement and joy because you are being assisted by the Archangel of Healing and Miracles the Mother Goddess of Healing and uh, Prophecy and she has told you you are healed you are whole and so it will be. And when you're ready, just open your eyes completely and welcome back. Thank you.